Kyle Turner for NECFrontRow.com here to bring you the NEC Super 7 Countdown. Let's take a look at the top 7 plays in NEC football from Week 6. We start things off at number 7. LIU's Michael Love hauls in this 67-yard bomb from Ethan Greenwood to get the Sharks on the board. Uh, lots of time here for Greenwood. Deep ball down the middle. He's got a man open. Big strike all the way down to the end zone. Diving in for the score. Long Island gets on the scoreboard for six. Beautiful pass from Greenwood as he found his man Michael Love for the score. Number six. Central Connecticut's Brady Olson finds Isaac Boston in the corner of the end zone to put the Blue Devils in front at Yale. 24 touches now for the junior from Knoxville, Tennessee. Central today, 6 for 11 on third down. A shot to the end zone. It is caught. Touchdown, Blue Devils. Coming in at number five. Third and eight for the Blue Devils. Elijah Howard extends for this catch to move the sticks for CCSU. Olsen on third down. Takes a shot here. It is caught. Elijah Howard, how did you do that? Number four, Wagner's Jake Cady scrambles, then throws across the field to Ricky Spruill for this 24-yard touchdown strike. To pass, pressure, rolls out right away from the pressure, has plenty of time, oh. launches it across the field, and it's caught by Spruill for the touchdown. I, I don't know how he saw him. Exceptional vision by Katie. Good scramble. Again, another example of his athleticism. Number three. Mercyhurst Adam Urena throws it up for Chaz Davis, who makes the grab and gets the foot inbounds for the touchdown. Inside the red zone again. Urena going to try to go for the kill shot here. To the end zone, man. Open. And the toe tap is made, but is it inbounds? Touchdown. It wow. Is. Wow. What a throw from Adam Urania. His third TD pass of the afternoon, and the Lakers are pouring it on early in this game. Coming in at number two, Wagner's Dan Katie pump fakes, then hits Jeremiah Kolklaw in stride. This goes for 77 yards, giving Wagner the lead. Got him. Launches Got him. down the middle of the field, and it's caught in stride. All the way to the end zone. Touchdown, Seahawks. And now for our top play of the week. It's another hurdle on the NEC Super 7. St. Francis Hughes' Markel Holman hurdles the defender and goes 30 yards for the go-ahead score in a comeback win for the Red Flash. Third period. Holman again dances to the outside, tries to hurdle a tackler, does so, keeps his balance. He'll go to the end zone. Touchdown, St. Francis. Unbelievable. He tried to hurdle over a tackler. The tackler hit him came down and managed to keep his balance and nobody hit him after that. Well, folks, there you have it. Those are your top seven plays from week six in Northeast Conference football action. Fans, don't forget, if you see a great play, let us know on X at NEC Sports. And don't forget to leave a comment below to let us know your favorite play from the past week. For NECFrontRow.com, I'm Kyle Turner, and I'll be back next week.